हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू इंडियन फैमिली इन सर्जर चैनल आई एम वर्तिका टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू अ मैथ टॉपिक व्हिच इज कन्वर्टिंग फ्रैक्शंस एंड डेसिमल्स लेट अस स्टार्ट विद अ बेसिक व्हाट इज अ फ्रैक्शन एंड वी ऑल नो दैट अ फ्रैक्शन इज अ पार्ट ऑफ अ होल व्हाट इज अ डेसिमल अ डेसिमल इज अ नंबर व्हिच इज लेस देन 1 बट ग्रेटर देन 0 and decimal numbers are always separated by a decimal point now let us come to the conversion side how to convert fractions into decimals so as you can see here 27 by 100 when we convert it it will give us 0.27 how you ask so in whenever we convert fractions into decimals we always have the basis of 10 numbers 10 and 1000 I have a video on this. The link will be given in the i button. So whenever we convert the fraction into decimals, we always have to look at the number of zeros. So here we have two zeros. So we have to convert the number into two steps to the right. I hope you understood. Now let us go to our next question. Three by hundred. Again, we look at the number of zeros, which is two, and then we look at the number. So, when we move the number two steps to the right, it will be zero point zero three. Now let us go to how to convert decimals to fraction. So we have a decimal here, zero point three two seven. We do the same as we do in fractions, but the but the opposite thing here is that we look at the number of places it has been in. so it has it is three places to the right so we have to check in the basis of 10 numbers that which number has three zeros with so the number which has three zeros is 1000 so we have to just we have to write the number here as the numerator and the denominator as 1000 sometimes we come across decimals which have a fraction which can be also simplified it's very easy you just have to write the number here as a fraction 75 and just divide it by whatever number you think it will be divisible to so here we had divided this by 25 which would give us 3 again we divide this by 25 which would give us 4 so 3 by 4 It's a simplified fraction for zero point seven five. I hope you have understand the conversion of fractions and decimals. I'll see you next time. Bye.